It is time for one of my favorite shootout challenges, but also one of the most difficult. Today, we're hopping into the copycat challenge where we take the move our opponent does and perfectly replicate it. If they dot suit flip, we dot suit flip. If they one hand, we one hand. You guys know the drill by now. We have two packs on the line and two shootouts. If we win, we keep it. If we lose, we discard it. But today, we're switching it up. For game one, we're keeping it simple. We have one of these jumbo NHL player packs with 10 80 plus overalls. Now, as you guys know, our pack look has not been great. So we're going to put one guaranteed card on the line for pack two. And that is these new fantasy hockey prospects. There's a set you can complete to get a random choice of one of these prospects. If they score a goal in real life, their overall goes up. And I'm telling you right now, we want the cider, nothing else. All that being said, it is time to hop in to shootout number one. Wish me luck. First, we have to get our random team. We got one, two, three, and the Columbus Blue Jackets. Okay. This is already shaping up to be a W. We're repping the hometown, boys. Warinsky's going to pop off. Line A's healthy now in this game. He's going to pop off. Let's get it. All right, here we are in our first game. And wouldn't you know it, we got matched with the all-time All-Stars. Now, I do get to go first, which means at least for the first one, we make our own move. And how about Patty Line? A beautiful dot suit. That's our one free one. From now on, we do have to copy his moves exactly how he does them. But listen, this guy's using the all-time great, so I think we deserve that one. All right, the thing I need to do here is be attentive. I need you guys. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, that was actually kind of nasty. So he went in. He did a leg fake around the blue line, walked in, just went forehand, backhand about 19 times. I don't know how he was going to try to finish it, but we will try to do the same. Here we go. Bang! Dude, this guy's moves are perfect. I mean, if I could just do him one step better than him, then we are set. We're going to keep our pack. Max Domi, nice goal, buddy. Also, it's a little bit sad for the Blue Jackets. Domi's injured. Line is injured. The first two guys that went in this thing, both injured. And we are going to have a chance to end this very, very early if we keep this up. So he went with a triple leg fake. So walked in. Bop, bop, bop. <gasps> the Charlie Conway triple deke. Dude, I might, I might add that one to my shootout moves. I'm learning a lot from this guy right now. There's, there's our third shot, third goal. Hey, let me know in the comments. Are we pulling these off well? I think right now, like... Right now, we're looking pretty good, and that is going to do it for our first shootout. I did not expect it to go this way, especially playing against the all-time greats, but uh, this guy set me up for success, right? He had the right moves, just didn't have the finish. We go out there, finish every single one of them, save every single one of them, and we're keeping the pack. Let's go. Okay, we won the first one, and that's great and all, but that one is for the pack. We know historically here in the shootout challenges, the pack's do not treat us well. So remember, the next shootout challenge is for that guaranteed prospect fantasy hockey card. We want the cider. We're not settling for anything less than the cider. And I'm definitely not going to give us the chance to discard a cider. Okay, we won with the hometown boys. We got team number two. One, two, three. And the Toronto Maple Leafs. This cannot get any better. Okay, it all comes down to this. It is Toronto versus the Avs. One game, one prospect fantasy hockey pack, and a copycat to go along with it. He starts all the way on the boards, does a little toe drag. Oh, okay, this guy's getting a little creative. I like this. So all the way to the side, toe drag, try to go backhand, forehand. We'll go all the way over here. Uh, toe drag. And then... What a move! Bang! That was actually to perfection. I thought we went past the goal line and it was a little bit too late. But no, we hold it as long as we can. We take our time. We use our patience and find that left side. Let's go. Obviously, we're not too bad at replicating the moves. The part that we're bad at is playing Tendi. So we're going to see... See if we can make a save. Not not today, unfortunately. Rantanen goes in. He cut across the blue line. Then I think this one was, again, just a nice, normal backhand forehand. This guy's keeping it very simple. No, ended on the backhand. My bad. So the finish has to be on the backhand. So he cut all the, all the way across the blue line. Comes in. Finish on the backhand. I feel like he might, he might know that something's up with how weird these cuts are. So if he catches on to this, we could be in a bit of trouble. We'll see what he does here, though. Nice save, Campbell. Big kick saving a beauty. I don't know why I just put my glove up. Okay, so that's a backhand forehand. He had a righty, so we're going to go with the lefty. I'm going to add a little bit of flair, you know, a little... Bang! Let's go 
Matthews. I am not gonna lie, he had that perfectly covered. I think anyone but Austin Matthews, and that puck probably doesn't go into the net, but we somehow snuck it in. We take those. Okay, we have the lead. Now, all we have to do is make saves. Oh, he's holding A? Little cover. Oh, what a save by Campbell. I mean, the whistle already blew, but a nice move there. So he held A, went back and forth like this, then sat here, put on the brake, and shot it. Let's go, Tavares. Let's go. And that is the game winner, too. I mean, you guys got to give me credit here. There weren't any crazy moves. Like, we didn't have to go for a behind-the-back one-hit or a Datsu flip, anything like that. But we replicated the moves today pretty well. I think this was maybe my best effort ever at the copycat challenge. Let me know in the comment section down below. We'll watch it back. Obviously, it's tough to tell in the moment, but I'm very happy with that. We get to keep the jumbo pack. We get to go over. We're going to complete the set and hopefully pull the fantasy hockey side. First things first, we got the jumbo NHL players pack. I've got a ton of packs right now. I think I'm going to save them for the next event though. I don't know if I'm a huge fan of these fantasy hockey cards. The only one I want is the cider. Or, you know, we, we would take the new Shane. We'd take the gold. I, I'll take anything at this point. So here we are. Our only pack of today's video. And it is going to be a big one. I am I don't know why. I've been seeing some pulls on the internet. I'm going to show you a pack that I just saw that was tweeted to me. A fantasy hockey Duchesne, a 92 overall McDavid, and an 85 in the mix as well. If I got just the 85 in this pack, I would be happy. And this man's getting all three in one pack after a bad rivals run. Like, I'm shook. So will today be our day? Probably not. We got three cards left, one card left. And our best pull is an 82. I'm telling you boys, there's something wrong with my packs. I don't know what it is. I don't know who we have to talk to at EA, but the things I'm seeing from other content creators and the things that I'm experiencing, they're not matching up. Okay, they are not matching up. Let's be honest, we knew the pack was gonna be garbage, but this is where our luck turns around. All of our bad luck from the shootout challenge comes to this, and this is our turning point. Okay, so we're gonna go to the random fantasy hockey prospect set. I've already filled in the set. You gotta toss in a ton of these 81s and one of these fantasy hockey collectibles. We hit Y, we complete the set, and we hope for the cider. I don't know how this pack works. It could be like a choice where you have like three that you pick from. It might just give us a random one. I don't know, but the only card, the only card that I want is the cider. We're going to pop this open. We just did the copycat challenge to perfection. We got two big wins. We deserve the one card that we want from this thing. In three, two, one. Please tell me it's a choice pack. Please tell me it's a choice. One in five or one in six, and we actually hit it. Cider, welcome to the team. This man has been popping off in real life. He already scored an empty netter on the first day that this card came out. He started as an 82, he was up to an 84, and it's already a W. I told you this was the turning point, okay? The shootout challenge is a success. Luckily, we won both those matches. Yes, the first pack was garbage. This made up for it. Let's go and that is gonna do it here for the copycat shootout challenge what a day man we're finally ending this thing on a positive note if you guys did enjoy the video hit it with a like to let me know hit that subscribe button we are almost at 600,000 subscribers so hit it quick i'm nasher i'm out and we'll see you guys next time peace